We are about to take an elevator ride 26 stories inside of a cave in the side of a mountain. And uh, it's to the Sky Lounge, it's going to be in approximately 30 seconds. I think it's on its way down. So we're going to be inside of a mountain. <sighs> Hello, we are 2,280 feet above sea level right now, top of Chimney Rock. Took this big old elevator through the middle of the stone and came all the way up 26 stories. And now everybody looks like little mices. And Liz is terrified. Her knees have been knocking ever since we walked over. We came across this bridge that wasn't too sturdy. It was like a swing bridge. And she tried to stand on her tippy toes, and I thought that was going to help. But that didn't help. And I keep looking over the edge like this, because I keep thinking of But it's fun. That's what's going on. We just are exploring nature and the world that God has created. It's kind of cool. Hey, hey, hey. Look how high we are. Over here by Hickory Nut Falls that way and Devil's Head the other way. I had to film this part of DTV myself because Liz is passed out on the way up here. And oh, here she comes now. She's here. She's gonna make it. She's having some difficulties, but I think we're gonna be all right. <laughs> so there we go. We look how far we out or how up we are. Hey Liz. You made it. I'm breathing hard too. I don't know what it is. I don't know. We're in a whole different atmosphere now. Look at that. Alright. She's gonna take a break. Alright, we're both gonna take a break. And we'll get right back at you with the adventures of Chimney Rock and Bat Cave. Hello. We've been stuck in this cave for at least two and a half hours. And we're trying to find our way out. Thanks, Liz. You say, let's go right. We go right. And then we'll be going in circle for the last hour and a half. We need to get out of this cave. If we don't never get out, I want to tell my family I love them. And this is all Liz's fault. All the money I got in the bank, which is negative twelve dollars, I leave to my family. I just want to live. I want to get out of here. I want to eat hot dogs again and go to hot springs and bath. I got nothing else. Okay, I'm a little disarray right now because I can't breathe inside the cave. Ain't no oxygen out here. Oh my goodness, there's a raccoon over there, and I'm gonna try to catch it and bring it back to Nashville. So everybody, wish me luck. DTV. I'm scared to get closer. Hey, you got to be. Hey, right there's a raccoon. <laughs> what if he tried to attack me? Alright, come on, man up, don't man up. Say raccoon, son. I'm a gangster. I got to trick him. I got to pretend like I'm a raccoon too. Ah, oh. and there he goes. Bye, the raccoon. I didn't mean to bother you. Everybody, say bye to the raccoon. There's a bear over here, and I'm gonna wrestle it down. Alright? <laughs> 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 
Uh, 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 Liz, help me put the camera down. Uh, 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 uh. Ladies and gentlemen, we are at the Hot Dog King. Now, that's two things I don't play with. It's kings and hot dogs. And you put them in the same sentence, and we got to see if they can live up to their name. So we're about to go into the Hot Dog King, which is my favorite food, hot dogs. We're going to taste these hot dogs and see if they really are the king of hot dogs. We have a foot that comes with uh, chili, mustard, onions, and slaw. Yeah, let me get two of those. Two uh, foot longs? Yeah. And some. And then you said add wood on there? Uh, ketchup, ketchup, ketchup. You ketchup on Yeah, yeah. Okay. And uh, some potato wedges, wedges, and uh, we're going to go. Potato wedges. I know, kid. So far, so good. The king of dogs are living up to their name. King of hot dogs. Look at this hot dog. It's nice and good. It's sloppy. It's beautiful. Mm. I love it. Okay, we just left the hot dog king, and it truly is the king of hot dogs. So much props to him. And now we're headed to Bridget's wedding before she pulls her hair out. She's a little. Frantic these days, so uh, we gotta make a quick run there. We'll see you at the wedding.